Creating consistent image using ChatGPT was always an issue. Now there is a solution available using which you will be able to generate consistent character images using ChatGPT. And this method also will work in any tier including the free tier. Let me show you what am I talking about. Currently I am in ChatGPT console. If you are using ChatGPT for the first time, use your Google credentials to log in. And also if you want to understand how to use ChatGPT, I have multiple videos available on this channel. Now coming back, I earlier copied one prompt from mid journey. If I paste it here, this is the prompt where I am asking it to generate one portrait. Now if I hit enter, then it will start generating the image. Currently, I am using the ChatGPT new image generation model. That's why it may take a bit more time to generate the image, but it is generating realistic images and it's much, much better than the earlier version where DALI was used to generate images within ChatGPT. I already published a couple of videos in this channel covering all these new features of ChatGPT image generation model. Now the image is ready. I'll show you how can you generate multiple images of the same person and how to do that. So for that, you need to understand one concept that is Gen ID. Whenever ChatGPT generates any of the image, it generates one Gen ID, which is actually the unique identifier of that specific character. Let me show you how can you get the Gen ID and how to use it further. So if I paste this particular prompt, give me Gen ID of the above character, which I'll use to generate subsequent images of same character. Now, if I hit enter, then it will start working and it will give me the Gen ID of that specific image. You can see this Gen ID of the above character is this one. So what I'm going to do now, I will repeat the same prompt and I will use this specific Gen ID. Let me do that. I pasted the prompt now. I'll copy this Gen ID from here. Then after I mentioned use Gen ID, then I'll paste that Gen ID there. Now if I click on this button, then it will generate the image for me. And let's see if it can generate the image of same character or not. Now you can see it generated the image and this was the image of the character when she was smiling and now this is another image of the same person. In fact, if you see in the background, what are the setup was there, color of the chair, other equipments, those also it kept as is till the extent it's possible and it generated the image. So this is for the same character. Now, if you find any point of time that in case after giving this Gen ID related prompt also, if it's not generating, you can mention it to ChatGPT that I gave you this specific Gen ID, but this is not the same character and then it will regenerate the image for you. When I was checking this feature, there were some of the instances where ChatGPT generated a completely different image of a different character altogether, though I mentioned to use the Gen ID. So when I reprompt it, it gave me the right result. If I just copy this earlier prompt by clicking on this copy icon and then I paste it here and only change I do instead of stylize 50, if I type 75 and then if I click on this button and let's see what are the output it can generate for us. Now you can see it generated that same character image again. If you see the same person here, she was smiling here, another image and this is another image. Now if I enlarge this image, now you can see as I mentioned style is 75, it changed the style a bit, but this generated image of the same character in all these images. So this is the way you'll be able to generate images of consistent character using ChatGPT. Just ask for the Gen ID and you'll be able to use it. While using Gen ID method, we can generate consistent character images using ChatGPT. Google Gemini also provides same kind of a capabilities. I published another video earlier. How can you use new model of Gemini 2.0? to generate consistent character images. Check out this video if you want to know everything about it.